What's going on, guys? And welcome back to the Quiche TV. On today, I'm going to be making some crab rangoon. In this bowl right here, I have one package, eight ounce package of cream cheese. Right here, I have some crab meat, imitation crab meat. Use what you got. You hear me? I have in this right here, I have some green onions. I have onion powder, garlic powder, some soy sauce, some Worcestershire sauce, and right here, I don't think y'all can see it. I have some sugar. <laughs> and uh, that's about it that I have for this right now. And I don't, uh, I'm gonna just go ahead on and put it in, put my crab meat in. I kind of packed the crab meat on into it, so it's like a heaping, a little, a little under a heaping cup of crab meat. And I'm open up my, open this up. I wanna put like maybe, cause it's maybe a tablespoon and a half of green onions. Start with my garlic powder. I don't know if you can see that. I have, let me bring this up some so you can kind of see it. I'm sorry, y'all. My camera is going sideways. I'm sorry about that. I have, that's maybe a teaspoon of garlic powder. Oh, I forgot this thing popped off like this. I have a teaspoon of onion powder. I don't really have no measurements for it, but y'all get the gist. And this is what you share. This is about a teaspoon of Worcestershire sauce. And this is, oh, come on. I forgot I just bought my um soy sauce, so I have to open it. <laughs> Give me one second, guys. One second. This should have already been open, seeing as though I was doing this video. But it is what it is. I mean, but my sugar can be open, though. All right, I'm gonna do about a teaspoon of Worcestershire sauce. I mean, of soy sauce. All right, so now I have my Worcestershire, my soy sauce, my onion powder, my garlic powder, and my green onions in, in this bowl. I have to put my sugar in here and I'm gonna put like, um, now that I'm gonna measure, I'm gonna put like a teaspoon of sugar. See, I have my, uh, my teaspoon right here, I'm gonna put a teaspoon of sugar in there. I don't want it to be too uh, sugary, so. Yeah, let me go ahead and get the teaspoon. Okay, and here's the sugar. Okay, there. And you know what? I'm gonna use what God gave me. I'm gonna use my hands and I'm going to mix this up. Because that way, I know it'll all be incorporated and it won't take so long to get it all mixed together. Because you know how some people use spoons and it takes forever to get all mixed together? No. I'm not trying to have my, not trying to have this video that long. See? Like that. And like that, we have... The mixture for the crab rangoon. Now at this point, I'm gonna taste it. Where's my spoon? I'm gonna taste it to see if uh, my flavors are where I want them to be. It is, but I think I want to add just a little more sugar. A little more sugar to it. Get it on the sweet side. Mix it up a little more. Taste it one more time. And this time I'm going to use the end of the spoon because I just used that spoon. All right. And there you have it. The mix for the crab rangoon. I'll be back when I have 
my station set up for the crab rangoon and everything. So I'll be back, guys. All right, guys, I'm back and I'm getting ready to uh, start to put filling in my um in my warm tone wrappers. Okay, let me see. All right, I'm gonna put just a little, you know, like about it's like what about a teaspoon. I have my water right here that I'm just gonna put on the edges. I'm only gonna show you this twice. I'm doing it because let's be real, it's gonna be real tedious trying to constantly trying to do this in real time. So, and I don't want. Have y'all watching this like that, you know. I ain't trying to bore y'all like that. Nah. Okay, so. Alright. Alright, I didn't did this like this. Alright, let me show y'all something I saw on YouTube. They dip it in right here in the middle. And they take... They take the uh, edges the ends and the cross them. I don't know if I'm doing this right, but I'm trying. So, and I don't know the name of it, y'all, so please bear with me. That's my baby in the background. Say hey, baby. Hey, baby. <laughs> y'all know that's no baby. And I mean, and here, this is what it looks like. I don't know if I did it right. I did two of them. <laughs> so uh this is mainly what the ones we're gonna be eating look like. We're gonna be eating it. We're gonna be eating this on a walking and fat woman's shoes. Are we? Yes we are. Let me do this one more time. Then I'm gonna be back with all of them situated. Then I'm gonna tell you how I'm gonna do it. Y'all gonna be what the girl keeps is tripping. She's tripping. But no, y'all, I'm not tripping. I'm not tripping. So, did you just say always? Maybe I did. <laughs> there she go with that lines of maybe I did. Where do you think he got it from? I know. All right. Because I ain't going to lie. Oh, we had the Chinese food yesterday and... It was good. It was good. I ain't wanna. I wanted more. I did. No surprise. So, yeah, because you know, after you. Sure. Tima was like, she said Chinese food sound good, but you know, 30 minutes later, after you need that, you can belch you, you be hungry again. You do. And that, that that's really true. It really is. But I ain't gonna lie. I ate enough of it yesterday. I wasn't hungry afterwards. Okay, let me do this one more time. Okay. Oh, I gotta make sure it's able to connect over here. And I'm pressing on it so it can stay like that. All right, I think I did good. All right. There it is. Here they are, and uh, I'm going to come back with all of them done. I might do different uh, kinds, but for right now, these are the kind I like, so I'm going to just do this. I might come back with the, with different kinds, you know, just maybe the one folded over, and that's about it. But uh, these are the kind I like right now, so I'll be back with y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, this is my finished product of my uh, crab rangoon. And I did some like this. I did some of the regular ones, as you can see. And I did these the way I like them. So, uh, I know I was supposed to tell y'all, okay, the girl went crazy. She was going to bake them. But I did a test run of them. And I'm sorry. I no. Because uh, the place that I got these from, I don't know. The company that does these, 
they put a lot of cornstarch on them if you can see it. And so I'm going to just go ahead on and fry them. I'm not going to fry them on camera. I'm just going to come back to you guys with the finished product and show you guys what I'm, you know, what it's going to look like afterwards. Because like I said, I don't want this video to be too long and drawn out. So I'll be back, guys. All right, guys, this is the finished product of my crab rangoon. Some of them came out a little darker than the others, but all in all, it's still good. I made a little dipping sauce that consists of soy sauce, fish sauce, sesame oil, and green onions, as you can see. And um, like I say, um, this is the finished product of my crab rangoon, homemade crab rangoon. And me and my baby, Mel Baby, will be on a walk in a fat woman's shoes eating these tonight. So, if you want to come over, it's a walk in a fat woman's shoes. And so, next time, you guys, I love y'all. Take care. Be blessed. Have a wonderful week. And so, the next time I see you, always remember to smile, smile, smile. And guess what? I'm going to push you down and pull you up later. Peace, guys.